Season 3 of Netflix's The Crown is upon us and it'll be the first time we'll see Olivia Colman as Queen Elizabeth II after Claire Foy's award-winning turn for the first two seasons. To be fair, Claire Foy managed to bring the audiences in with her performance and really gathered up a fan following in the two seasons. But Olivia Colman is already gaining some steady buzz as being a strong match to Foy, which is what the creators have been after. And Olivia Colman will have her two seasons to make an impression as the Queen of England and the first trailers already have viewers pretty impressed with her rendition. In an interview with Indian news outlet Hindustan Times, director Benjamin Karen reflected on the decision of moving on to a whole new cast. The idea of starting again with a new cast could be a moment of brilliance or an act of self-harm. He added, it would have been a disaster if Olivia Colman was trying to be Claire Foy. You have to make these parts your own. And that's the hope with Coleman's Elizabeth. But given that The Crown has been greenlit for a total of six seasons already, it's fairly obvious that the makers of the show will scout for a third Elizabeth to round out the final chapters. And if the rumor mills are churning out the right ideas, Dame Helen Mirren could take on the role of Queen Elizabeth II yet again, but this time for a series rather than a feature film. Mirren first played Elizabeth in The Queen in 2007, for which she also won the Academy Award. She also played the same role in a play titled The Audience and was awarded a Tony for her performance. She certainly seems like the most apt choice given that she'd walked these paces before as an actor. Moreover, Peter Morgan, who is the creator of The Crown, was also the writer of The Queen, which means that bringing Mirren on board could be the most logical conclusion to this. Morgan even said in an interview once that Mirren follows the crown and loves the show. However, it's a wonder if Mirren herself will want to reprise that role yet again, given that she told Lorraine Kelly otherwise during an interview. When asked if she would take on the role on the crown if offered to her, Mirren answered with a tentative, I don't think so. She added that it's more interesting when you see other portraits and it builds into a more interesting picture than just someone coming back. Well, whatever the fate of season 5 and 6 of The Crown, it remains to be seen how Olivia Colman's turn is received by audiences and critics alike. The Crown season 3 premieres on November 17, 2019. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, be sure to check out all our other content and don't forget to subscribe.